guys welcome back to my channel so I'm back with another makeup tutorial and this is the look I'll be creating for you guys and to achieve this look I use the tails neutral palette it's really really pretty as you can see they're all neutral colors and I'm going to list all the products I use in my description box so you can check it out if you're interested so don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe if you're not Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in another video really soon. So I'm going to prime my face and I'm using the NYX Pore Filler Primer. This is a matte primer. I'm just going to allow my makeup to stay in place and remain matte. So now for my brows, I'm using the Colourpop Brow Pencil in Brunette. And I'm just going to use that to outline my brows, just following my natural brow shape. I'm just doing the same thing to the other side of my brows and I'm just filling it in with the pencil as well. And now I'm going to clean up the brows and I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Warm Honey and I'm using my MUD Flats brush. I've had this brush for like forever and I'm just using that to clean up. And now I'm just blending out the concealer with my Real Technique um, flat brush. And I'm going to prime my eyelids and I'm using the Urban Decay Primer Potion. And I'm just applying that all over my lids. And now I'm taking my Tails Neutral Eyeshadow Palette and I'm taking that shade as my transition color. I love using orange, matte orange shades as my transition color. I don't know, just looks really nice. And I'm taking the other shade and just applying that right on top of the orange. And now I'm taking that brown color and I'm just using an angled brush to just cover out my crease. And I'm just covering out the area that um, where I see the fold in my eyes and I'm just using that to cut the eye if it makes sense. And I'm just blending that out. And now I'm taking my MAC Select Cover Up Concealer. I'm just going to apply that all over my lid to just make the lid precise and cut my crease as well. And now I'm taking that color and I'm going to apply that all over my eyelid. And I'm just blending out. And now I'm taking this EJ Slugs glitter and the Benign glitter glue. And I'm just going to apply the glitter right under the um, line that I cut. And I'm using a real technique um, eyeliner brush to apply this. Now I'm just lining my eyes. I'm just cleaning up the liner to just make them really neat and sharp. And now I'm taking this foundation. Like I love this foundation, guys. I'm just going to use that to match my neck because you have to make sure your face and your neck are the same color. So yeah. I'm just going to apply that with my Juvia's Place foundation brush. Now I'm taking my Ellie Girl Pro Concealer again. I'm just going to use that to highlight the T-zones of my face. So 
spray my beauty blender with some setting spray and I'm just going to blend out the concealer I actually take my time to blend and blend very well I might, I might not just show it but I actually take my time to really blend till I'm okay with the blending And now I'm just taking the same foundation brush to just blend out the lines and now I'm taking my MAC Conceal and Correct palette and I'm using the darkest shade I'm just going to use that to contour Now I'm just blending again and I'm going to set my face and I'm using the Sasha Buttercup powder and I'm going to set all the areas I highlighted. And I'm just applying mascara to my lashes and I'm just going to fix my lashes. Now I'm just dusting off the excess powder out of my face and I'm going to set my contour using the bronzer by CoverGirl in Ebony. And now for my blush, I'm going in with the MAC Ambrain Rose Blush. And I'm just applying that all over the apples of my cheeks. Now going in with my Tails Ivory Tower Highlighter. And I'm actually going to use all three shades to highlight. Now I'm using my Marbrook Eyeliner and I'm going to line my waterline. And I'm applying some mascara to my lower lashes. Now for my lipstick, I'm going to mix Tails Gold Coast lips, Lipstick and Tunis Baby. And now I'm going to set my face and I'm using the Gerard Setting Spray. And this just locks everything. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys love this tutorial because I do. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys really, really soon in another video. Bye.